Hi, my name's Nick Butler, and in August of 2020, I challenged myself to draw a comic a week for 52 weeks. I created all my comics using Adobe Photoshop, but in May of 2021, I was commissioned to create a webcomic using Adobe Fresco. Fresco is built for the Illustrator, with many of its primary controls up front so you can get to them easily. In this video, I want to talk about the seven Fresco features that make it ideal for webcomics. One, pixel brushes. I did my initial sketching using the four pixel pencil sketching brush. The pixel brushes allowed me to block out initial layouts and compositions with tools that felt familiar and comfortable. Two, drawing aids. I mostly used the circle drawing aid to create partial and complete circles, arches and ovals. The aids worked with pixels and vector brushes. Three, easy layers. The layers were right up front, big and easy to group, but I couldn't find a way to label the layers. Maybe they will do this in a future release. Four, touch shortcut. The touch shortcut magic button makes tools do the opposite. Pixel brushes erase in a similar fashion as they draw, and the lasso selection tool subtracts from the selection area. No more holding alt. Five, vector brushes. I always struggled with drawing with the vector brushes in Adobe Animate, but the vector brushes in Fresco feel different. I used a 0.5 basic taper vector brush, with the smoothing set to 70. The vector brush gives me some flexibility with scaling and resolution. Six, line clipping. Line clipping uses the third click on the touch shortcut button to quickly and cleanly remove line segments. This was by far my favorite feature. Seven, no shift lasso selection. I did not take advantage of Fresco's enormous coloring and painting features, perhaps in another video. With the ability to make multiple lasso selections without having to hold the shift button, I'm able to make color areas and masking selections quickly and easily. Well, I hope these were helpful. Thank you and check out more resources at turtledustmedia.com.